What's up, guys? Uh, <clears throat> here's a little better picture of that big 18650 battery I was talking about before. You see that nice amber? This one doesn't have... I'm charging the battery on the other one. This one don't have bands on it yet. I need to put some on it. It's just a precaution. I mean, in three years, I've only cracked two. And one I cracked was my fault because I was trying to do something with it stupid. Like, take it apart and do something. <laughs> and I ended up breaking it. But I was able to take the oil out and put it in one that was like half full, so it was all good. <clears throat> and the last one I broke, I was able to do the same thing. So, but I'm getting ready to run down the road. Um, I'm probably going to take the Specialized. I'll show you guys a little ride on that bike. How about that? But first, let's take a blast and then we'll take a blast on the bike. I was corny as fuck. These big 18650 batteries, I will give it to them. They are really powerful. Like, <coughs> <coughs> see, it's a button top one too, so you can tell it's old school. And you just take it, it's an AW. Uh, 3.7 volt, 2200 mega amps. <coughs> it's usually common with the old school mouth to lung devices. But anyway, it's right here. Put it in. Screw it in. It lights up, letting you know it's working. <coughs> if it's off, you gotta click it five times, but it's on and My mustache growing in good. I can't wait for a no shave November, but I'm gonna have to shave down here probably because I might have to get a job. And I can't grow a full beard because I got Native American and African American in me. And I don't grow hair from like here to here, so it looks like chops. <coughs> Man, you can start to really tell that I don't have no teeth no more. Besides the way I sound. It really fucking sucks. I'm craving crunchy shit like a motherfucker. Man, I want a crispy pizza and a fucking beer. <coughs> I want uh, I want french fries I want anything fucking crispy <laughs> I want my rice crispy treats alright here's a high octane on the G2 as you can see here it's a little better this front camera has mega less megapixels but it seems to be Maybe more HD. Okay, there's a little bubble right there. I don't think you guys can see it, but I can. Let's see if I can get it in there. See that little bubble? Well, if you turn it upside down, the bubble will. See how fast that went? Watch that bubble. The 
It's already there. See? Now watch this one. See how long it takes that. This is top shelf. This is hey, what can I afford when you get to the front desk? <laughs> I mean, they are cheap, like 20, 30 bucks max, probably. Max, I'm saying. Cause this is not a half a fucking grand. I don't know why they make them, because, right, I'll show you, okay, because I'm getting pissed off about this. Let's see, right here's one of my half grand ones, okay. That's a half grand. Look how... See the difference in that? Like, look how much fatter it is, too. Trying to get where you can see you good. You see how much bigger around the cartridge is? Not the drip tip part, but right below it. That's how big around the glass is. Drip tips probably got pocket lint and shit. Let's see. Oh, I don't know how to try to show you that way, but it's just way smaller than a half. It's like a quarter of a gram. I think they market it as like 0.35 grams. Like, what the fuck's the point? Like, why not just measure out regular? It's like, it's like a millimeter and standard, like, metric and, st like, st metric and standard fucking tools. I hate it. I wish they were all fucking metric, man. Millimeter. You can just say, hey, I need this number instead of, oh, I need a 11 sixteenths or a 5 eighteenths. Like, I hope I have it. Like, <laughs> that's why my dad had to spend so much money on tools when he became a mechanic. Yeah, he spent like fucking what, like, five grand on tools just to become a mechanic because he needed those tools, like, because he needed both of them and you need special tools. And then he had to buy extra special tools. Like, I don't know if you ever took a fuel line off of a newer car, but there's a tool that you got to put on the fuel line. It's like a ring. And the only way I can describe it is like, say this pencil is a fuel line, and the eraser is a connector. Well, the ring slides onto the, and it slides underneath the connector and pushes a pin and pulls it out, and lets it let you pull it apart. Well, what what I did was take a fucking Mountain Dew pop bottle. And I cut a little plastic ring and I popped it right off because it was like a hundred dollars a day to rent a tool. No, you couldn't even rent it. It was like a hundred dollars just for them to fucking use it at the dealership. It was a dealership only tool. Like only a dealership can get it or a certified mechanic. But luckily he now he's certified. Ready to go. You can get mechanic liens and shit. So if you don't pay, it keeps your car. And you only charge is eight dollars an hour. So if you're like around 
the rich man to like I don't want to say too close to where I live, but like I guess the Wayne County, Randolph County, Henry County, all them county lines, like I guess the uh, yeah, let me know. Indiana, by the way. But I'm currently in, uh, I'm currently out in LA right now. I'm uploading these videos to YouTube because it's easier than by the way, best vape juice ever. And I just got five bottles of this shit. It's on its way. Uh, my two favorite brands and my two favorite juices right here. Well, there's also Party Punch. But my favorite brand is Verdict Mega. I sport it all the time. I'm trying to get sponsored by them, but I don't have enough subscribers or views. Very mega. That's what's all in here. It's filled with the uh, watermelon rush ice that I'm a third of the way through. And this 60 milliliter bottle, I'm going to get a 100 milliliter next time because it's five more dollars for 40 more liters. But mega it's made by verdict vapor watermelon rush ice let's see what do i have on the way oh and aqua smoke <clears throat> that's a uh, aqua smoke uh, party punch they're a really really good brand you see them everywhere but at smoke shops they got some really good flavors like this right here in Indiana now also every juice made this is locally made aqua smoke too maybe that's why it's everywhere here but they have to have QR codes and it has every ingredient and flavor in it and where it came from manufacturer all that maybe uh, I don't have enough room I was on a squirt a little fruit fusion in it I usually vape uh, six, but I vape three as well. And this is uh, Fruit Fusion. I'm glad Aqua Smoke finally started using the Unicorn bottles and the Chubby Gorilla bottles because these right here are hard as hell to get into your tank. Well, guys, I have to go make an errand. That's what that sound on my phone was. Don't know if you heard it or not. But... I'll start adding the stuff to the descriptions that I say I'm going to in the videos because I need to because I say I'm going to and I need to anyways just to get <clears throat> more information out there for you guys about what I'm doing. Um, I do a lot of stuff. Uh, a lot. A lot, a lot of stuff. Um, anything, everything you can think of is on this channel everything <laughs> but uh yeah so hit that like please please hit that subscribe i will subscribe back if you do um i will and uh i will like a video that, that i watch full that i do like and uh so i may like multiple because i might have to watch multiple but anyway i'm gonna get out of here guys so, peace out. Stay out of trouble.